Galaxian for the Atari 8-bit computer line. I love the arcade game Galaxian. It's a game I play quite often. Uh, it's, it's a very enjoyable game. I know Galaga is probably more preferred over Galaxian, but there's something about Galaxian I've always liked. I don't know what it is, but I love the arcade game. And when they put it out on my Atari 8-bit computer, I was so happy when my dad brought this game home for our Atari 800 back then. Played this game a lot. But anyway, it's got a really great looking box. I love the artwork on here. Play the arcade game at home for the Atari 400-800 home computer. Also works on the XL, XE line as, as well. 16K RAM required, so definitely works on Atari 400, that's for sure. Of course, on the back of the box, we got a nice screenshot of the game screen. Pretty cool. Relentlessly they come, the Galaxians! <laughs> cool. Blaster be blasted. The one thing I can't figure out is why Atari made such huge boxes. They got this huge, stupendous box and an itty bitty cartridge that goes inside. <laughs> that's great. That's wild. Now compare this to a Atari 2600 box. Holy cow! Why is it so big? They could have made it this size, no problem. I don't know if maybe they did it to differentiate the computer software from their 2600 line, 1700, that kind of stuff, or what. But they got this thing about making stuff huge every once in a while. You know, take for, you know, since the Atari 5200, how big it is. Well, they got big boxes for the Atari 8 bit line now. Anyway, in the box, of course, we have the cartridge. Pretty plain. Galaxian computer game. Used with joystick controller. CXL 4024. No way in love, but it says left cartridge. Because 800 had two cartridge slots. But it's on this side. But they're neat looking little cartridges. I love finding these when I'm out and about looking at retro game stores. I keep an eye out for these Atari 8-bit cartridges. They're fun to collect. Got quite a few. Also in the box we have the instruction manual. Full color by the way. Awesome. Shows how to hook it up into your your system. Put it into the Atari 800. Use the select key. You got the start key. System reset. And the space bar is used to pause the game which is kind of nice. If you want to go get a snack or something or take a break from an assault. Uh, you just hit the space, space bar. It also warns when using the pause feature, do not leave the game for more than 15 minutes or you may damage your TV screen. <laughs> Get some burn in going, yeah. Of course we have a story. I love it when they put stories in these in these manuals. Last chance for planet Earth. When you join the Intergalactic Warrior Fleet, you never bargained for this. Your Earth ship is soaring over the vast blue horizon. Suddenly, an, an entire fleet of Galaxians comes winging in from deep space. There was no time to get the other ships in the air. You're the only one who can stop the Galaxians. But behind the first wave is another, and then another, each faster and more powerful than your last. Can you do it? Can you stop them? You bet you can. No, you can't. Because the game doesn't end. There is no end to this game. So eventually, you're doomed to die. <laughs> <laughs> but you can, you, you'll get a, uh, let's see what we've got here. You get an extra ship at 5,000 points. This has the point levels here. you got your stationary targets, how much they're worth. When they're in flight, they're worth a little bit more, like double the, almost double in some cases. Pretty cool. Basic arcade rules. I like the strategy session here. Fire as often as possible and then shift back and forth between the galaxies. Do not waste a shot. Yeah, shoot like crazy, dodge like nuts. <laughs> That's the best strategy you're going to have. <laughs> Skill levels and scoring display. This is, a, this is such a great game on the Atari bit. It's one of my favorites in my collection. Uh, this actually came out of the Atari, Atari I.O. Retro Junk Box I participated in. So I was pretty happy to get a hold of this. Uh, I found a manual separately from what this came in the box so I can make a complete set to make this video. Because I've never really done a 
unboxing video of an Atari 8-bit game on my channel. So I thought this would be a good first time unboxing for an Atari 108-bit computer game. This is what I remember back when it first came out. There's these huge boxes. Uh, Star Raiders, you know, Galaxian. A few other ones came in these big boxes like this. My dad had a whole bunch of them. I wish I would have kept a hold of them, but I didn't. But that's here or there. I'm rambling. So let's get done with the rambling and let's go play some Galaxian on my Atari 800 XL. Awesome. Galaxian! All right, here we go. Player one. This is actually a pretty good version of Galaxian. I've always liked playing this on my Atari. Dancing around up there. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, he's coming after me! Oh, got him! I mean, when I first saw this game in the arcade, uh, I played it for a long time. Wasted a lot of quarters on it. I don't know what it is about Glax that I really like. Now, I know Galaga is a much better game than this one, because it has a lot more going on. But there's just something about Galaxian that I've always liked. I don't know what it is. Now I love the star field in the background. Oh no! Oh <laughs> Oh. oh! Let's try the pause feature here. This is kind of cool. I can pause the game. That's awesome. Oh, I like how they strafe. You think they're just so sneaky. Oh man, I could have got some good bonus points there. Had to destroy the two escorts first. Ooh, that's close. Got me. At least I got an extra guy. Ah, oh. got kamikaze. Oh, 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 oh no, 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 no. <laughs> Doing my dodging skills. Oh! I weave when I should have wagged. Well, 6,800 points. Not one of my better scores, but hey, it's a really fun game. I can play this game quite a bit. It's really enjoyable. One of my favorites on my Atari 100 computer. Anyway, that's Galaxian. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching.